Good morning guys. It is Arika Misha and we are cooking Sunday dinner. Um, today I am going to cook pot roast and as you guys can see I've got my pressure cooker out. Yep, got my pressure cooker out today. Got Big Willie out today. So um, we're going to cook a pot roast in my uh, pressure cooker. Um, I've had this pressure cooker for about, I don't know, about two years now, three years now. Uh, yeah, I've been about three, three years, maybe even longer. I don't know. My daughter, my oldest daughter got it for me for my uh, birthday. Um, but anyway, um, okay, so we're doing pot roast. Um, you guys see, I've got my pressure cooker out. I've got my honey gold potatoes. I've got my green giant carrots. I've got my progresso beef broth back here. Um, I've got my trinity mix, which is celery, onions, green peppers. Um, and I've got my yellow rice because we're going to have the pot roast over yellow rice. You guys know uh, I've got the Vigo yellow rice. I love that yellow rice. It's just like the Mahatma yellow rice. Really good. And my pot roast. I've got two pot roasts. Two big pot roasts, guys. Let me, let me show you guys. You guys can see it. I've got two big pot roasts in there, guys. And of course, y'all know. I seasoned them yesterday, so they've been marinating overnight. Overnight, guys. They are ready. You hear me? I'm ready. Y'all know I'm greedy. I'm ready. Uh, but anyway, so yeah, that's what we're doing today. Uh, pot roast over yellow rice. And of course, we're going to have those potatoes and carrots and that beef broth all in there. Oh, this is going to be good. <laughs> Y'all know. I'll be ready to eat. Uh, but yeah, let go. Okay, guys, I had to go get my hand help because that uh, tripod was not uh, able to see down in this pot. So, I had to go get my hand held so y'all can see what's going on. Alright, so, I've got two cups of oil. Actually, let me let y'all know. First, I have my Instapot on saute. So, um, I got two cups of oil. Let me get y'all back to some good light. Ugh. Okay, so I've got two cups of olive oil in the bottom of my Instapot down there. And the only thing I want to do, and you guys see I've got my pot roast in there. Yeah, I'm sorry about that lighting, but it's down in the Instant Pot, so it's kind of hard to see down in there. But anyway, so I'm just going to brown both sides. And don't forget, guys, I have two pot roasts. I've got this one here, and I've got the other one over there. So basically what I'm going to do, I'm just going to brown both sides of these, you know, down here in the oil. Just going to brown both sides of them. That's the first thing I'm going to do. So, I've got this one already down in here browning. Flip that over. Okay. So, it is browning. It's getting all nice and brown for us. Okay. Show y'all that. I'm going to flip it back over so it can brown a little bit more. But just so y'all know, I wanted to let y'all know what I was doing. I'm browning both sides of the roast. Just going to brown both sides first. And then I'll be back to show you guys what I'm going to do next. Because this is a process. This, this isn't one of my quick get in and out of the uh, kitchen meals. So when you cook them pot roast, it's a process. So, Alright guys, let me get both of these browns on both sides. And I'll be back to let you guys know what's next. Okay guys, my next step after I've browned the pot roast on both sides, I've sat those to the side. Um, and now I came back, I added a tablespoon of butter. Um, I added my mix, which is the celery, the onions, the, fruit, the green peppers. I added that to the butter and I also added a tablespoon of garlic and I'm sauteing it now. Sauteing the garlic and the onions and all that, getting those all sauteed up now you guys can see oh it smells good uh-oh uh-oh y'all hold on fogged up my camera all right okay so i'm sauteing all that guys uh that's the next step and i will be back to show you the next step guys okay guys so now what i've done is i've added two cups of beef broth one fourth cup of Worcestershire sauce. Y'all know what I'm talking about. Um, I added one cup of vinaigrette, 
and this is to, as you guys know, to the onions. So, um, one fourth cup of vinaigrette, and I wanted to show you guys what I used for the vinaigrette. I used the balsamic wishbone, uh, you know, balsamic vinaigrette dressing, any vinaigrette to do, whatever you guys want to use. So, I used that, let me repeat that. Okay, so to my saute onions and stuff, I've added two cups of beef broth. You guys saw the Progresso beef broth I used. Two cups of beef broth, one fourth cup of Worcestershire sauce, one cup of vinaigrette, and I've already mixed that well. So now I'm gonna go ahead and add both of my uh, chuck roast uh, to the, you know, what you guys see here boil. I'm gonna go ahead and add both of those. I'm gonna go ahead and um, put my pressure cooker for 40 minutes. I'm gonna set it to 40 minutes, guys. And I'll be back to show you guys what's next. It's a process, guys. All right, I'll be back. Okay, guys, I just wanted to come and show you the yellow Vigo rice um, cooked. Um, I just added the water uh, per the instructions. I added the water, the two cups of, of two cups of water, um, two tablespoons of oil, and I cooked it for 20 minutes, covered on um, medium low heat. So yeah. That is our Vigo yellow rice, looking delicious. I just at least wanted to come in and show you guys the yellow rice because I'm sure the pot roast is going to take over this whole video. <laughs> alright guys, that is the yellow rice, quick and easy. The rice is always quick and easy. But, alright, let's get back to this pot roast over here. Okay guys, it's been 40 minutes. Um, I just took my, well actually released the pressure in my Instapot. Um, took my top off once the pressure released. And you guys see those two pot roasts looks delicious. Yes, I'm gonna zoom y'all in. They look so good. Oh my goodness, look at all those those seasons and herbs and spices. Mm mm mm. And I just seasoned the pot roast with whatever seasons you want. I just seasoned with my regular seasons. Uh, well, first I oiled it, oiled it all over, and then I put all my seasons: garlic, salt, pepper, uh, complete. A complete season you know whatever seasons you guys want to use that's what I did and I marinated it overnight so all right guys so our pot roast is ready I'm gonna go ahead and take the meat out and I'm gonna make like a I'm gonna add a little flour so that we can thicken you know what actually no duh what am I doing see y'all I'm so ready to eat I gotta add my potatoes and carrots that's sitting over here in my face like what what you doing girl God, I'm so greedy. I'm ready to eat right now. So what I gotta do, I gotta add, cause I'm, I'm holding my tripod. So I've got the handheld today so that you guys can see down in this Instapot. So I'm gonna add my potatoes and carrots. I'm gonna add the potatoes and carrots and I'm gonna put it uh, back for 20 minutes. Let it cook for 20 minutes, you know, to get these potatoes all done. Get these potatoes and carrots all done. So you guys see I'm adding the potatoes. And I'm gonna put it back on 20 minutes so that my potatoes and carrots can cook. So, get these potatoes and carrots in here. It is hot in here, y'all, it is hot. You gotta be careful with the pressure cooker. You definitely gotta know what you're doing with the Instapot with a pressure cooker, you know? Gotta know what you're doing. You can't be playing around with these Instapots. So, I've cooked all kind of stuff in here. I've cooked spaghetti, all kind of stuff in here. I haven't tried cooking desserts in the Instapot yet. I don't think I want no dessert out of no Instapot. I'm sorry, that's just me. I don't think my kids gonna want no desserts out of the Instapot either, so. All right, I'm gonna push those potatoes down let me get my hand cleaned off and I'm gonna go ahead and um let me get my little my little thing here go ahead and get those pushed down in that juice yeah get those pushed down in that juice you know so they can be cooking all right oh that look good y'all look look at look at the little pot roast peeking out y'all see it he ready for me to eat them I'm ready Look at him peeking out. That's all right, buddy. Don't worry. We gonna eat you up. But doesn't that look good, y'all? And it's not even done yet. It looks so good. Get down in the juice potato. I need all that cooked up. 
All right, guys, so I'm gonna go ahead and put it back in for uh, under the pressure cooker for 20 minutes, and then I'll be back to show y'all what's next. All right, y'all. All right, so our 20 minutes are up, and our carrots and potatoes. Oh, look at that pot roast. Mm -mm -mm. I keep letting y'all get fogged up. All right, let me just use my zoom. All right, and our carrots and potatoes are all nice and soft. I checked them out. I tasted one of the potatoes and they were delicious. And I'm so ready to eat. All right, so what I'm gonna do now, I'm gonna go ahead and pull the pot roast out and set it aside, you know, set it aside from the juice. And then I'm gonna add about one or two teaspoons, no, one or two tablespoons of flour, it just depends. Cause I wanna get my, um, let me get my thing here, okay. Cause I wanna get, see my gravy, my gravy isn't, you know, isn't that thick. So I wanna add a little flour to it so I can thicken this gravy up. So um, I'll probably add like one or two tablespoons, however you, however thick you want it. So I'll see if it's one tablespoon, two tablespoons, maybe three, I don't know. I'll see how many tablespoons it's gonna take for me to get the gravy as thick as I want it. So I'm gonna go ahead and do that. Um, and then that, that's it guys. That's it, the pot roast is done. All right, guys, I'm sure this has been a longer than usual video. Um, you know, I'm definitely going to start cooking other things aren't, that aren't so quick. I mean, I don't just cook quick meals. You know, I cook it all. I do it all. God has blessed me to do it all. <laughs> Believe it. But, all right, guys, our pot roast is done. You've seen how I did it. Um, you've seen the yellow rice. It will be pot roast over yellow rice. And I also baked the cake. So, um, make sure you guys go watch that video. It's going to be like a rainbow cake. So, all right, guys, this is Arika Misha. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Follow me on all my social media at Arika Misha. And don't forget, guys, knowledge, it's power. Thanks, guys. Bye.